When saliva, food and fluids combine, they produce bacteria deposits, which collect where the teeth and gums meet. Plague contains bacteria, which produce acids and attack your teeth, enamel and can damage your gums. If not treated, the damage could become permanent. It contains millions of bacteria that feed on the food and drinks you eat every day. If bacteria deposits from plague on teeth aren't removed through regular brushing and flossing, they can cause tooth decay, gum disease and tartar buildup. Over time, if plague isn't removed on a regular basis, minerals from your saliva are deposited into the plague biofilm, causing it to harden within 24 to 72 hours, turning into tartar. And while you can remove plaque at home, tartar removal requires the help of dental professional. Did you know 68% of adults have tartar? Tartar, also called dental calculus, is a yellow or brown color deposits that forms when plaque hardens on your teeth. Because tartar buildup on your teeth is strongly bonded to the teeth enamel, it can only be removed by a dental professional. You have a greater risk of developing tartar with braces, dry mouth, crowded teeth, smoking and aging. Individuals vary greatly in their susceptibility to tartar buildup. For many, these deposits build up faster with age. What causes dental plaque and tartar? When saliva, food and fluids combine in your teeth, they produce an environment that allows the bacteria to grow and deposit which collect on teeth and gums and especially where the teeth and gums meet. Common foods that contribute to plaque formation and growth include those containing carbohydrates or simple sugars. Eating foods high in sugar like cakes, sweets and fruit can cause an increase in plaque bacteria. Plaque bacteria can lead to gingivitis, carries an advanced gum disease, so it is important to take steps for treatment and prevention. Plaque hides between teeth and under the gum line. There is no way to avoid it entirely. So it's important to maintain a good oral routine to keep it from accumulating. Certain foods, especially carbohydrates, foods containing sugars or stretches, are big contributors to plague growth such as milk, soft drinks, cake and candy. Spotting the early signs of plague on teeth. Plague can be a pale yellow color, but it can also be colorless making it difficult to see. That's why it's important to maintain good oral hygiene and see your dental professional every six months for a checkup. They may use dental mirrors to spot plaque in hard to see places. If you want to know whether you're removing plaque properly from home, try staining it using plaque disclosing tablets available at your local drugstore. By staining and exposing plaque, it's easy to tell where you may need to do better job for brushing and flossing so you can effectively remove plaque at home. The tablet stains can easily be brushed away. So tartar buildup, on the other hand, bonds strongly to enamel and must be removal by a dental professional. Which is why it's so important to be proactive and remove plaque before it becomes a problem. If you start seeing any signs of tartar buildup, be sure to see your dental professional.